Hi, this is Zach with NRS, and today I want to talk to you about throw bags. Specifically, I want to talk to you about restuffing your throw bag after you've used it. I'm also going to cover some of the general inspection points that go along with the throw bag. Everybody swims, as the old boating saying goes, meaning you're probably going to use a throw bag at some point in your life, um, either to help save somebody else or they're going to use it to help get you out of a bad situation. So it's important to know how it works, but more importantly, it's to know how to reuse this bag, restuff it, so that next time you go out on your adventure, it works again, just like it's supposed to. So when, we talk, when we're talking about st restuffing this throw bag, I want you to think about it as we're actually stacking the rope back inside of this bag. Um, that's going to do a couple of things for us. We're going to get one continuous, nice, even stack in here. And then when we go to deploy that bag, that rope's going to come out in that same way. It's going to come out in one even continuous line. Uh, that is going to help us avoid some of the things like bird's nests or snags, coils, that sort of thing that might happen um, if, you, if you stuff this bag differently. So at this point, we've rescued our, our friend, the person in need. Everything is fine. Everybody's back on shore. Now we have the rope all out of the bag. This is a good opportunity. You have to restuff it anyways, but go ahead and take a look. Inspect your knots. Make sure everything is still fine. You don't have any tears or anything in the bag. And then go ahead and restuff your bag. So first we'll look at the knots. Make sure they're, they're good and tight. These are just figure eights, as all these are, at this loop end and also at the, uh, the tail end of the, of the rope is also another figure eight with a loop handle on it. Inside, just a little stop knot. Not a big deal if that uh, gets loose at all, but make sure it's still there. Um, it keeps your float in place and keeps the rope from running through. So the bag looks pretty good, maybe a little dirty, but that's all right. So at this point, you want to restuff your bag. Your ultimate goal is to get the rope back into the bag in sort of a stacked manner so that when it's deployed again, the rope comes out evenly and quickly without any hang-ups. You're not getting any uh, large bird's nests that come out at a time. You want this rope to come out in one single straight line. Um, my preferred method to do is I throw it over the shoulder and then I'm holding the bag with three fingers from each hand as such, and then I'm actually uh, er, manipulating the rope between my index fingers and my thumb as I'm putting it in here. So you don't, I'm not taking a whole lot of rope at a time, so it'll take a second to get this restuffed, but that's okay because I'm really taking my time to make sure that this rope is going back into the bag properly. And it also allows me to inspect the rope as I go. I can look it over. I'm feeling a lot more of the rope for abrasions and cuts. All right, as we come to the end of our rope here, first thing we want to keep in mind, we want to inspect this knot. Make sure this is still a good knot for us, good and tight. And it looks like this one is for us. Buckles, the cinches, those are all okay. Now, when you're closing your bag up, I like to have the knot in the bag and the handle outside of the bag, so I'll hold it and then I will cinch the bag around it, down with the barrel cord, and then I also like to run the strap back through the handle, just a little extra security. Um, you can go ahead and use this buckle to attach it in your boat or somewhere in your kayak. We know that it's ready to go at a moment's notice, so next time we're in a rescue situation and time is of the essence, this is gonna perform correctly for us. If you have any questions about throw bags or any other rescue equipment, please feel free to give us a call, or you can visit our website at nrsweb.com.